What's up guys, DSEC28 here, and welcome back to Agario, part 3, to be exact, in Agario. Today is still July 2nd, and we still got the Peach Orchard Punch as the drink of the day with our Boise State Cup that we got from Arby's like 3 years ago. Oh yeah, and then you know what I didn't talk about? Why is my face, God, the color balancing on this camera blows, this phone just blows. But you know what I didn't talk about when I on my previous episodes? I don't have a green screen. Yeah, that's different. I don't have a green screen because I took it down. Since we're packing up, I, had, I just took it down because we needed to patch some of the walls. Um, so yeah, know what I mean? So I don't have it, not now. Um, it's all good though. My face is so freaking white and I hate it. Look at this. My phone, this, guys, if you guys are getting a new phone, but you're not looking at getting, like, a brand, brand, brand new phone, don't go with the HTCs, or, like, I don't know about the M9, but probably the M9 as well. Do not go with the HTC M8. It's like, oh, my God, it's, it's seriously, when I, okay, it's, it's a good phone, but ever since the 5.0 update, I don't know if I've talked about this either, I have no idea, but. Ever since 5.0, I know I've talked about it lightly, but today's episode, we're going to be talking about my goddamn phone, okay? Ever since, fuck you, little dick. Ever since 5.0, Google 5.0 Lollipop, this phone has been trash. Okay, when I first got it, it came with, I believe it came with, I know it came with KitKat, but it was, I think, 4.4.2 or 4.4.4. I don't remember, okay? I don't remember. It was a great phone. It would never overheat. It was fine. The battery life was awesome. It, literally, everything was good on it. There was nothing wrong with it. Fuck you. Leon Messi for Argentina. He scores a go. Okay, okay. But uh, it, it's bad. Okay, it's freaking bad. So, I'm going to go turn off my light. Hopefully, I don't die. Hold on. Quick, 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 quick. Oh, I almost got a kill too. Okay, uh, that's not better at all. It's kind of like scary. <laughs> Holy balls, Takim, you're huge. But okay, going on with the phone. Let's take a sip. Ass wax. Ah, did not expect that. Okay, going on with the phone. When I got it, it was awesome. It was a good phone. It was fast. It was everything was good. Okay, I download 5.0, and so my mom's as well. She has a um, Samsung S5. Her my dad's is fine. He has 5.0 as well. His is like, it's okay. Sometimes it lags and stuff, but it's not like my mom's is bad too. Ever since me and my mom got 5.0, it's complete shit. But I'm going to talk about my story because I know my story better than hers. Okay. This is what's going on. My phone. It overheats like no fucking other. Okay. And I think, I, but I don't remember it doing that last summer. Okay. I, I, I've had this phone since last summer and I don't remember it overheating in the summer a lot. I honestly don't. I remember leaving it out and stuff like that. It wouldn't overheat. Now though, I literally can't like I don't know where to put it in my car. No matter where I put it with the windows up, with the windows up, windows down, air conditioning on, air conditioning down. If it, if there's sun pointing in my car, I don't know where to put my phone. I put it in the middle console, it still overheats. I put it freaking in the dash. It's not the dash, but the um Glove compartment still overheats. I put it under like my freaking ass, pretty much. I'm like kind of sitting on it, but like putting it right there overheats. Like not overheats where it turns off. Once it almost did. I don't know where to put. It. I can't like especially with this like hundred plus weather that's been going on recently for us. It's bad. And then battery life is complete shit because of that because it gets hot and therefore the battery dies faster. But it's like unbearably so like. Especially when I'm recording like this, it's it like it's gonna drain. It really is gonna drain. And talking about recording on my phone, I forgot to turn on Do Not Disturb. God damn it. Anyways, it, it's it just does not. It sometimes okay. Like and another thing is it lags like no other. Then the 5.0 is um when you open up recent updates. I mean not recent updates, but recent uh, programs that you've been running. It used to be you just click one button and it would just clear all. And that was with the old school HCC layout where it had only nine, so it three by three by three. So I had three on each slot. And if you didn't have the clear all, it just like nine, you know? 
But with this 5.0, it uses the sli uh, the slides or whatever they're called. Yeah, slides. So there's like up to like 40 fucking slides at once, and there's not a clear all button. And those apps are all running, making my phone even slower. So I have to individually slide every single one, every single day. And it's unbearable. It takes so fucking long, because mo half the time it won't even slide over. It just won't work. It literally takes like four minutes for me to fucking clear out my apps. It doesn't make any fucking sense. There's no clear all button. It's stupid. Okay, that's another thing. Another thing is my battery. Another thing with my battery. <clears throat> It'll be at 18%. No. 18% means fucking 1%. Because it dies right after that. Like, so the highest it's ever been. It was one time at 30 fucking percent. And it just died on me. And then I turn it back on. It's at 1% and it dies. I'm like, hold on for a second. You're at 30 fucking percent. I understand when a phone drops from like 6% to 0. Completely makes sense. I get it. But eight, like my average is like 16 to 18%, where it just dies on that percentage. It makes no sense. <clears throat> it's stupid. It really is. This 5.0 update, and like I was doing research. I was trying to figure. Sorry, I was. I heard my dog's bark. Sanic. Uh, I was trying to figure out how do I get my phone to be fixed. Okay, because other people have issues too. Some guy said, like, whenever he, his phone gets really hot, when he turns it off, when he turns it back on, it drops, like, 70% of his battery. I was like, that's fucking insane. Mine's not that bad, at least, because I never turn it off. There was one time, though, I did have to turn it off, because I held it in my hand. I think I actually talked about this in one of my crew episodes. Sorry if you can hear the music again. But, um, I'm, like, playing better when I'm not even paying attention. <laughs> but, uh, it... What's it called? What, what was I gonna say? What was I gonna say? Oh yeah, it got so hot I couldn't even hold it. I had to like, hold it like this. I know I've talked about this before. It was a crazy. I was like, really? Like it was so hot. I don't even know. It was like 106 degrees that day, so it was bad. Thank you, Pika. But um, the other thing I was gonna say is, oh, fuck you, Frank. If you get me, come on. I'm at 331. Don't get me, bitch. Okay, good. Um, another thing is, um, what was it? What, what was one last thing? One last thing. I forgot what it was. Um, damn it! I don't know what it, I don't remember what it was. Ah, oh, what was it? It was. Um, gosh, I really completely forgot right now. Charging time. Oh yeah, and then like my charger just broke, so I have to like hold it a certain way in order for it to charge. So normally when I go to sleep, I have to put something like a platform type thing on my, um, oh, where's my mouse? Gosh. Uh, I have to put like a platform thing on my charger because it has to push down in order to charge now. Don't know why. I literally didn't do anything to mess it up. Uh, but uh, well, there's one other thing. Oh yeah, research. I was doing the research, trying to fix it. Okay, so this is what happens. This guy's all like, you know, doing a factory reset on updates on Android normally really like is the way to do it. So I was like, okay, so I have to do a factory, especially on like big changes, like, you know, KitKat from Lollipop. That was a huge change, even though it really didn't fix anything. It made it worse. But um doesn't even look that different either. I know the stock one looks a lot, what the hell is that? Oh, Sunday. Um, it looks a lot better on like the stock Android of how it looks. It makes sense, I get it. So it was like, you know, 5.0, Reset your phone. Do a factory reset. I was like, okay, you know, Google has all my shit, freaking saves and all my contacts. You know, the SIM card has my contact. It's all good, you know. I do the factory reset. You know, I have no pictures or anything. I put actually all my pictures on my computer. Everything was backed up correctly. And I turn it back on. All my factory uh, contacts are gone. So I have no contacts except the people have that have texted me recently and like my parents, obviously. So that was a thing. You better not split, bitch. He's gonna split. Anyways, um, I I did that. Didn't help. And then I read another thing is uh sometimes micro SD messes it up. So I was like, oh, I have a micro SD in my freaking phone. So I take it out. Ah, oh, I was in split. I was I clicked it too late. So I take it out. And you know I take it out. There's literally nothing on it. So. I didn't really, like, I just took it out. 
Reset my phone again. Not factory reset. I should do that, but it's 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 not gonna work. I know it. But um, I do that. I take it off. It didn't do anything. So my phone is just trash, and it's even worse because I don't have my ringtones. I don't have anything that I have on my last one. So. I don't know, it's really pissing me off. My phone is complete shit. My friend, he has a HCC M7. The old, the previous generation one. Well, I have the previous generation one. He has a two, previ two previous generation ones. And his is the same thing. I literally, right, he got the Moto, uh, no. He got the Motorola, um, what did he, the Moto G? Is that what it was called? I don't remember what it was called, but it was an awesome phone. I'm not gonna lie. The battery life on that thing was fucking insane. It really was, like, because we always used to hang out, especially during the summer when he got it. It was an awesome phone. It was uh, Luis, Assassin Scarface, the guy I played Battlefield with. V1534, his brother. It was an awesome phone. It really was. Like, the phone was great, oh, except one issue, one massive issue. He can't talk on it. Whenever he would make a phone call, it wouldn't work. Like, the microphone wouldn't work or something, right? So he went to oh fuck. He went to Verizon and got new ones. He had like three. He he got like pretty much three of them. Didn't work. Last time he was all like, "Let me just switch phones because I'm sick of this." So he switches to the HTC M7. Okay. Ever since the day he first got it, it was trash. Like his battery life blew because you know I would hang out with him. And it's like he's charging it continuously. It sucked ass. It was terrible. It just everything was bad about it. And then. So he was like really pissed about that just because um, his his HTC was just terrible compared to the Moto. But um, god damn, if I can grab some of those. Fuck you, Salad Queen. Oh no, he got me good. Okay, I was too stingy on that one. But yeah, ever since he got that, complete trash. And his phone overheats just the same way as mine. I'm literally doing nothing on it. Like, it, what was he doing? Oh yeah, no, we were just walking. Like, I don't know what we were doing, but... We were just walking outside, and you know, it's like hotter, and we like pull out our phones, they're fucking hot as hell, I was like, okay, I guess that works, it's so stupid, it really is, I can't stand these phones, um, but I don't, I don't know, I, I'm definitely gonna be switching to Apple, might as well, it's not, I'm not saying Android sucks, I honestly am not, but I don't root my goddamn phone. I don't do any of that shit, okay? The only thing I would be missing out, to tell you the truth, on Android is Showbox. And that's where, like, I watch my movies. I don't even know if that's legal or anything, but you can download it. It's an application you gotta download on, like, Google Chrome. It's called Showbox. That's the only thing I will be missing, just because you can't download third-party applications on Apple. But other than that, I literally won't be missing anything else. I don't root my phone, so I don't do all this crazy shit i don't do anything like specific android stuff i really don't like the only customization i do to the android is fucking my background and my ringtone or some shit which i don't even know i don't know if you can do that on iphone and i personally don't really care and like the other thing is with mine is like it just crashes fucking a shit ton oh you bitch it just crashes a shit ton so it's like you know it just crashes and crashes here on this application Oh yeah, and like I already talked about this, but my bank application like keeps opening for some reason. Don't know why, but it's stupid. I hate it. So I, I think I'm just switched to. I've always been with Android ever since 2010. So it's like might as well switch for once, at least for two years or anything, you know? Because but when my when my thing is done, it's April, so new phones are gonna be coming out. Um, so there'll be the iPhone 6s, I'm guessing. So I just want to stick. I just want to go to Apple, try that out because it's like you can't. You can't bash on something you don't try. I know that Apple is a weaker, like the, the RAM is weaker all the time and stuff, but they make the phone for everyone. It's the same phone for literally everyone. Therefore, they don't have to deal with so many drivers. They don't have to deal with that stuff. That's why they don't crash, just because it's one phone. They have to, the apps that are made on that phone are made for that phone, and that's it. There's no other phone that they have to deal with. We are doing good. We are doing good, okay. But, um, Four, four balls, that's kind of dangerous, but you know what I mean? It's just like, yeah, so, oh, fuck you, cock. Okay, good, you didn't get me. But you know what I mean? It's like, might as well, might as well try it out, you know? I've, I've had, like, like, I've played with iPhones. They're, like, I need a phone that can text, that can call, 
that can go on the internet. Fuck you, turkey bitch. That can go on the internet and that can fucking... That's pretty much it. Okay, I'm gonna go up and then get my re regroup. Oh, you bitch. Oh, god damn it. I hate turkey turk. I can't split because I'm not gonna be able to get him then. But yeah, I think I'm just gonna switch to iPhone next April, I'm hoping. With the new 6S or whatever it'll be. We look so cool. We look like a gang. But yeah, that's pretty much that. Sorry about ranting on my phone this whole episode. Because after my death, we are going to end this episode. But that's pretty much my phone situation here. Oh, next episode, we'll talk about cars for sure. We're definitely going to talk about cars for the next episode. Um, oh, okay. I got to go down because that was not a picture that you guys should see again. Why am I having these issues? So I have to edit this. It was a picture of a guy and a girl. And that was like pretty much a pure picture of that. So don't know what his name was. Oh, I have to block that out too. So I got to remember part two and three, I think. Freaking A. People. Boss. Should I split for him? Yeah, might as well, right? Screw it. W equals peace. There you go, buddy. Oh, I gave it to the wrong guy. I hate this one because it's just so. It's all techno, but it's so short. Uh, I don't even know what agars are. Agar, whatever. I think they're like, um, what's it called? They're like, um, fuck. Oh, I'm so stupid. Don't say you can eat meat. Okay, you probably can. Shit, that was lucky. Um, I think they're like cells or something. Like it's like organisms. I think that's what we are. I seriously think that we're organisms and we're just trying to grow by eating other organisms. I think that's what agars are. But I'll figure it out by the next episode. I love this song, it's so sick. Man, my freaking camera rate is like literally going so slow and shit, it's not doing good. Don't fucking get me. Oh no, ah, I was gonna join, but he got me. Fucking ass. Oh, screw him, he got me all. All right, we're gonna end this episode here. Next episode, we're definitely gonna be talking about cars because I got some things to talk about. But yeah, thank you guys for joining me on part three of my adventure in Agario. If you guys like to hit the like button down below. If you wanna see more, hit the subscribe button down below. And yeah, you guys have a wonderful and beautiful day. DSEC 208's out.